They've had some tough luck in conference play, but it tells you how strong our conference is. And not only that, we're coming off of a, of a tough, tough loss. Sometimes the toughest losses are the ones where you kind of have them in your hand and they get away. Right. And so you wonder how you guys are going to respond. And uh, Texas coming in, we got to respond, and yeah. hopefully in a positive way. Let's look at the highlights now of Missouri's big win over Texas, and we'll kind of tell you about uh, how things went as we uh, look at the video, of course. And, uh, well, I mean, Truman making a grand entrance, Coach. You knew <laughs> it was going to be a special night for your guys oh, in the man. blackout crowd. Oh, that's beautiful to watch there. And there's <laughs> beautiful to watch J.T. Tiller. He hits the off the glass there, and he was contesting the shot. You can see we're rebounding the basketball, and we're in an attack mode, getting it up down the floor. That was Justin Sapper with the finish. 6 nothing Missouri, and the fun was uh, just getting started. Now 8 nothing with a tiller basket. Great backdoor cut. And, and again, you can see there's a defensive intensity. You see guys on the floor, ball movement, people movement, attack mode, skip pass. Kimmy knocks down the three, and of course, there's the energy in the building. You bet. 11-1 to one for Missouri at the start. And... Uh, Michael Dixon in off the bench had a big game, 13 points. He really made an impression. Boy, that's pretty. That's good quickness going against the big mm -hmm. Pittman, making that nice tack move. That's JT with a great screen, and, and Bowers gets to the hole with a left-hand layup. That was a deflection, and deflections are big in what we do. JT attacked, and how about the follow-up by Keith Ramsey? And we'll see a few more Keith Ramsey follows a couple in crunch time in the second half, but this is Mike Anderson, Missouri Tiger basketball, isn't it? Absolutely. Uh, attack, <laughs> attack, attack. Yep, Tigers left. You know, Texas briefly got a one-point lead for literally four or five seconds in the second half because Kim English came down and scored. But, Mike, impressively, you led this game from start to finish with literally like a four-second exception the entire way. Well, it just tells you the mindset, the focus of our basketball team. You hear we talk about rebounding. How about the offensive rebounds? Stick back by uh, Keith Ramsey. And, of course, Texas, very talented. Hamilton, kid. Oh. I'll tell you what, we didn't have an answer for him all night long. He was knocking shots down. Led left them and right. in scoring, yeah. Excuse me, coach. More than 20 points, but Hamilton and Bradley, two really talented freshmen. But you've got a pretty good sophomore. Kim English is taking the ball to the basket a lot. Absolutely. Under control. There's Zaire doing the same thing. I thought Kimmy had a stretch where he, he really kind of took control. He is on defense, mm. knocking away the, the alley oop pass. And that's, that's what I mean. Guys making plays. It's not necessarily just offensively, defensively. Well, we're going to see some defense from your team in this second half. Meanwhile, Hamilton. Cans another from long distance, and he really uh, kept Texas in the neighborhood because, again, Missouri had the upper hand. Look at the position, Keith Ramsey inside against the big Texas ball club. You talk about plays, and that's what you got to do. You got to make plays, and there's Keith Ramsey with another stick back, offensive rebound. How about Kimmy knifing through there? Uh, again, we were in attack mode. You could see we were really pushing the ball up the floor and tacking the basket. How about this? Nice. Kimmy English to Michael Dixon. And he had the nerve to say he thought it was Lawrence Bowers. <laughs> but great finish by Mike Dixon, and he makes the free throw for the M1. And how about a little more Mike Dixon uh, coming up as the Tigers force the turnover? And look at the uh, speedster Dixon ahead of the pack. Boy, that's fast there. Mm. That's fast. And you can see. The defense is creating uh, easy offense. I mean, that's getting to the basket. That's quickness. Mike, this is a key stretch of the game, too, because he scores five consecutive points to put you out from a two-point lead to a seven-point advantage. Well, you're absolutely right. We had momentum, and I thought we took advantage of that momentum. And here we go again. There's a stick back, Keith Ramsey. Yep, Taylor missed. Ramsey followed. And uh, as if someone just said that, check it out another time. There's Tiller, not quite, but Ramsey to clean up. Back-to-back -back tips. Big plays, and I thought it put us up, uh, it took that lead up yeah. maybe from 12, dozen. 8 to dozen. Exactly. To you bet, went from 8 to 12, and pretty much all she wrote, although I know you're never comfortable to the final horn sounds, but, but Missouri up double digits, Bowers getting it done, and uh, then a goaltending call against Texas, and Mike Anderson, uh, congratulations. Great win there. That was that as Missouri wins uh, by five after Texas actually hit back-to-back three-pointers in the final 12 seconds to make the final margin five. But, Coach, so much to talk about after a game like that. You know, points in the paint. You outscored a big Texas team. You got to the free throw line so often in the second half. It just shows the aggressiveness, I thought, that your team displayed against this Longhorn team. I think you're absolutely right. And I think it's a sign of our kids are hopefully growing up and understanding of what, you know, attack basketball is all about. We recognize Kim as this week's Missouri Employers Mutual Player of the Week. Uh, the sophomore led Missouri with 18 points in the win over Texas. 
He also had 13 points and three assists in that close game at Baylor. Kim English leading the zoo in scoring, averaging better than 14 points per game. And we remind you that MEM is the state's number one provider of workers' compensation insurance.